one, Miss Art here to share with you the books that I have read this month in this August wrap-up video. This month was very heavy for me on one particular series, the Throne of Glass series by Sarah J. Moss. Mostly due in fact that I am going to be going to an event with her, this author, at the beginning of next month. I think it's next week. Oh gosh. I really want to avoid getting spoiled at the event, so I just buckled down <laughs> and read this. Oh, okay. My history with the series is the first time I read this, I could not really get through it. I just couldn't get behind the main character. The main character is a strong female assassin, but she's also very much a girly girl. And that really came through in this first book, and I think, I, at least in the beginning, it was hard to grasp the balance between this idea of a excellent assassin and someone who just loves dressing up and going to balls. <laughs> a hard balance to strike but now that I'm getting into the second book that balance is actually it's actually working out so yeah not a bad debut and I'm happy that I gave it a second chance but uh, I don't have a copy of the second and third book so my wonderful friend over at uh, my wonderful bookstore allowed me to borrow the galley copies of the second book and the third book but while I was waiting I started Silver on the Road by Laura Ann Gilman I have not read any of Laura Ann Gilman's work. Apparently she has several books out, a couple series, but I've, I've just never heard of her. This story is like a reimagining of the Wild West with a fantasy twist to it. So far, I didn't get too far. I'm about that far in. Strong female character, a little on the slower side, but the writing is really strong so far. I may come back to it after I finish with the... <laughs> <laughs> Throne of Glass series. All right, so I'm working. I've been working on the second book, Crown of Midnight. I'm almost done with it. About that much left to go. This is definitely a much stronger book than the first one. You can really see the growth of the author's writing evident in this second book. And once I'm done with that, I'll be going on to the third book. Funny story with this particular galley. <laughs> and again. For those who don't know, galley means advanced reader's copy. This is an uncorrected proof. I got this exact copy, like this, <laughs> I originally owned this one, but I wasn't reading the series at the time, so I gave it to my friend. But lo and behold, uh, I was like, hey, can I, can I borrow that copy again? <laughs> that one I used to have. So this particular copy is like going full circle for me. I'm having a lot more fun than I thought I would with this Throne of Glass series, especially considering how it started for me, which I just, I couldn't do it. <laughs> but now, now that I've gotten past the first book, things are really progressing. It's a fun fantasy with assassins and political intrigue. I mean, and magic, what more could you want? So that's my little update. Thank you guys for watching. And as always, let me know what you guys are reading or what you were able to read this lovely month of August. This very hot month of August. <laughs> but yes, please leave your comments below in the description box. And remember, manga counts too. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. I always love those gestures and feel free to check me out on all the socials. Links below in the description box. And I will see you guys tomorrow for my Naruto anime review. And then we'll go into fillers. No! <laughs> But I'll see you guys tomorrow. All right, have a good one. Bye.